hi everyone welcome to a new video today we're going to show you how to fix this uh, error if you want to use virtual box and uh, you will receive the same problems we have a, a solution but according to what i've seen this is something i discovered myself but on youtube there are different videos fixing the same problems all the same problem but it didn't work for me or they didn't work for me so i want to go here I want to install another operating system using VirtualBox, but I'm on Ubuntu. It doesn't matter which um, operating system you're using. So now I'm going to type in VirtualBox. VirtualBox. So when I click on VirtualBox, I open it. So I did all my stuff here. So I want to install. When I click here and I say start, I encounter this problem. You get me? it says kernel drive not installed that's what it says the virtual box linux kernel drive is neither is either not loaded or not set up correctly but i'm telling you this is not the issue based on me on my operating system so there are some solutions on youtube watch them if mine didn't work for you but or doesn't work for you but I've watched them they didn't work for me but maybe they work for other people so but I have the one which is working for me and it could work for you too so what you're gonna do close all this go to your system here and what you do you do a uh, you turn off your system which means you shut down completely so yes we're gonna shut down the power okay so I'm using a source. I don't think it matters which, what you do. Okay, now what you do, if you're using a source, okay, go to your BIOS. That's it. Okay, please press for me F2. In a source, you press F2, then you the on button. Once you press the on button, you keep on pressing F2. Then it's gonna take you here. Once it brings you here, then you leave the button done. What's gonna happen now? You're gonna go to um, security. It depends on which operating system you're using, but the most the major thing is to switch off your secure bot to be off. Say enter. Then when I'm here, I can click on secure bot, which is enabled here. I say okay. Oh no, I went somewhere far. Uh, no, I have to click here and say enter. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to disable secure boot and say enter. Okay, once I'm done with that, I have to look into and see F10. I press F10 to save. So I'm going to go to F10. When I press it, it's going to pop up something like this. Then you say enter, which means okay. Okay, then it goes off. Once it goes off, it's fine. So it's going to come back, right? This machine is too fast it won't take time once it's on it's gonna be same time wow you can see simple done then it's gonna require my password of which i'm gonna put in then enter getting that where well. okay the machine is fine icons are ready everything is fine good so once everything is fine what I'm gonna do I'm gonna click here and search for virtual box once I get it I did reinstall and install whatever and it didn't work so since I'm there, then if I click here and I say start, you're going to see what's going to happen. You can see now it wants to install and it will install. So install Kali. Okay, you have clicked the mouse. Let me see cancel here. So you're going to be able to, to do auto board capture. It gives me some... You have clicked call to mouse to inside the virtual box. Display your process hotkeys. Okay, capture. Okay. 
okay i have no problems here i'm gonna be able to install my kali linux on my virtual box select the language right choose the language so, to be used for the installation process it has the started language will also be the default language for the install system so language one c no load so it was giving me issues it wants me to select a language here of which i can select any language i want portuguese english whatever so we don't even have to be here so i think i have solved your problem uh, try that switch off virtual box once you're done with virtual box i'm looking for english no i'm saying switch off your secure boot secure boot is the problem for me, which was it was my problem say polish and all that prompt for help this is not something i wanted to do i don't see english here but guys that's that's it enjoy your installation i'm done with that i'm just looking for the language to to do what to proceed with my stuff auto key excuse me auto key right whatever something i don't have to be in here for auto capture keys whatever mouse integration and all those things i'm looking for um, english but since i'm a person who's settings and all that i don't need to be here anyway i should conclude this video and i go let me cancel this see yes don't need help saving state a saving state so if i come back i think it will start the same place double click it and it starts it again give me the same thing it's asking for the english whatever select a language it's gonna be another problem which i have to overcome but anyway uh installation is easy to do uh i will cancel everything i'll delete everything here then i reinstall a new thing so since i don't have a problem with that anymore i'm gonna do what remove and say remove files also then what i'll do i'll click on new then i tell myself where i'm going to select the operating system that then i call it and uh, then i proceed with my stuff um okay i'll say next next and do my stuff thanks for watching guys don't forget to subscribe i hope this helps and if it didn't help try find other videos on youtube because those ones fixed other problems some people's same problem but mine it didn't work so until when i came up with this it's working for me and you so if it worked for you please leave a comment and uh, yeah, that's it. Thanks.